closer to home, a Bloomington nonprofit believes making homes out of recycled material is one way to help end homelessness. And you can help by mentioning them when you buy at mom and pop shops. Stephanie Rodriguez reports now from the Twin Cities. For businesses here in Bloomington and all over central Illinois, giving back to the community they serve is a big deal. And they tell me they're excited about having hope in 2020. There's hope for 2020 to start changing people's lives forever. Chris Collins is asking you to have hope this year as he's teamed up with around 600 businesses in central Illinois to raise money for his nonprofit. If you say you're a hope supporter when you spend your money in 2020, they will donate up to 20% of what you spend. If you see this sticker, you just have to mention hope and a portion of what you spend will go towards buying a $175,000 machine that turns scrap metal into steel. To frame homes, Collins says, will house people in need. We feel like we're helping people all the time with, you know, getting them on bikes, getting them healthier and everything. But if we can, you know, use what we have here to outreach to other people, I mean, it's just amazing. Collins says the homes they plan to build are cheaper and more sustainable. This machine makes 120 feet of material a minute. That's 100, 1,500 square foot homes a day. They won't burn. They won't absorb water. They're stronger, termite free, mold resistant, seismic, recyclable. Build them without a dumpster, build them cheaper than wood and get a 60% discount on insurance versus a wooden home. Another business participating is Smoke and Glass in Bloomington. Something to better our community and their support with local business and getting the word out there and everything. Um, it's just if we can help the community, they help us, everything, you know, great. it's a greater place. Chris Collins tells me that they're about $50,000 away from making a down payment on that machine. And once they have it, they'll begin making those homes here locally as soon as possible. I'll have information on how you can help on our website, week.com. For now, reporting from Bloomington, I'm Stephanie Rodriguez, 25 News.